here we are. It's an exciting time of year to talk about the new bows from Elite Archery. We've got some incredible new technologies we've been working really hard on that are going to change the way you look at a compound bow. And the first bow in the 2020 lineup we want to talk to you about is the result. The result is our all new offering in the target lineup for 2020. This bow is packed with new features that have never been seen before in the archery industry that's going to change the way you tune and shoot your bow. We've got an all new cam system with tons of adjustment in it, but the first thing I want to talk to you about is set technology. It's simplified exact tuning. And what that is, it's a new adjustment in the limb pocket that allow you to adjust the position of your cams for your tuning. So if you're broadhead tuning, paper tuning, bear shaft tuning, whatever you're doing, we've revolutionized how that is done with set technology. So set technology, how does that work? This is an all new limb pocket system. It's a two piece limb pocket and it's a micro adjustable pivot on the rear of the limb pocket. You know, historically when you're tuning your bow, if you're, if you're bear shaft tuning and you're getting a, a little bit of a tail right out of your bow, generally you'd put the bow in the press, you'd take it apart, and you'd move spacers to space the cam left or right to get the lateral knock travel and to get your arrows flying how you wanted. You don't have to do that anymore. You don't even have to put it in a bow press. All you have to do is loosen the lockdown screw and there's a micro adjust on the side that pivots this limb pocket and changes the, the loading on the limbs, which achieves the same result that you're getting from spacing bows in the past. How do you adjust that on your bow? So if you're shooting your bow, you're bear shaft tuning, you're getting a, a tail right condition out of the bow, you can adjust that right here at the limb pocket to fix that. And all you would do is you loosen the lockdown screw and you'd adjust the micro screw on the side clockwise for a tail right condition, counterclockwise for a tail left condition. And you do that at the top and the bottom of the bow at the same time and then lock it back down. And this adjustment goes a long way. It does not take much. There's about two revolutions of full adjustment range on this and it may only take an eighth of a turn or a quarter of a turn to uh, address what you're, what you're seeing. Um, it, it really is super effective. You're getting a couple degrees of rotation on this limb pocket and, and that effectively emulates what shimming a, shimming a cam would have done in the past but there's no bow press required, there's no special tools, all you need is an Allen wrench and you can do this right at the line. When talking about a new bow, one of the most important components on your bow is the cam system. That's what generates the energy, it's what creates the draw force curve, the feel, and over time Elite has been a two track cam system. That has been a great cam system, it's allowed us to develop that shootability, the feel, what makes an Elite bow an Elite. Well, we've taken everything good about that and we've developed a brand new cam system. This is the ASIM Tri-Track Cam System. It's brand new for Elite. It's brand new for this configuration for the archery industry. We've been able to get the feel of an Elite bow, the high let off, everything that an Elite cam has been known for and incorporate a rotating module, limb stops, cable stops, all kinds of adjustments with your, with your stops We've got a balance cam system. It's a tri-track system with a cable on each side which balances that cable load on your axle which keeps the cam really stable at full draw. There's all kinds of cool stuff with this new cam. Um, really excited to be able to bring this out. There's a huge draw length range. You know, we're going from 24 inches to 31 inches with this rotating module cam system keeping really good efficiency, really good feel throughout the entire range of the, the draw cycle. The new ASIM Tri-Track cam system allows you to run whatever kind of stop you want. You can run a limb stop, you can run a cable stop, you can run both stops together if that's your preferred feel, and it's super easy to adjust. When you get your bow with an ASIM Tri-Track cam, the cable stop will be installed. There's four different positions you can run the cable stop in, depending on the feel you're looking for, the holding weight you're trying to achieve. The four positions will range somewhere between 90, 70 and 90 percent let off. So if you want that elite feel, that super deep valley, you can run this all the way in, you're going to get that out of it. If you want more holding weight, all you do is loosen one screw, slide the cable stop out, and you can achieve that as well. You would do this on the top and the bottom of the bow, 
put them in the same position, top and bottom. And then if you're someone who wants to run a limb stop, your limb stop would actually mount to the cable stop in one of these five holes. Once you find the hole that you want it in, you set the top and bottom onto the cable stop, and you can get that rock solid, hard back wall feel out of this cam system as well. So when we're talking about a target bow, a couple things come to mind. Accuracy, stability. And we focused on both of those with this new design, but I want to talk to you about the stability portion and how we achieve that. So when I say stability, that's rigidity. It, it helps with aiming, it helps with forgiveness, consistency. And we've got a wider limb platform in this new limb pocket. We've got quarter inch axles, we've got bigger bearings. Everything is making this really rigid and stiff at the limb tip, which will just provide additional forgiveness, additional stability, a better aiming bow all around. So as you can see, there is a ton of new technology in this 2020 Elite Result target bow. And throughout all this testing from Tommy's feedback and Nathan and Darren and Derek, we saw how obvious all the benefits were of this new technology on the target bow platform. And we knew we had to incorporate this into our hunting bows as well. So everything we just talked about on the 2020 result bow, you're gonna find in the 2020 Elite hunting line as well. And this is the 2020 Elite Cure. So for us, when we made the decision to incorporate all this new technology into the new hunting bow platform on the Cure, it was a no-brainer. If, if you're a bow hunter, you deserve all the latest and greatest in technology that the target platform offers. So with set technology, you know, bow hunters and target shooters are not all the same, but if you're shooting, if you've ever experienced trying to tune broadheads, if you're a bow hunter, you like to shoot a, a fixed blade broadhead and you screw it on before you go hunting and it's hitting four inches to the right of your field points. That bow could be fairly well tuned, but you're getting a little bit of a, a knock left condition coming out of the bow. Your broadheads are hitting to the right. What do you do at that point? Do you recite in your bow for your, your fixed blades? It's not the best way to fix it. Now with set technology, you can fix that on your bow. You don't need a bow press or any special tools. You can micro adjust this limb pocket and dial your field points and broadheads in to be hitting the same exact point. This benefits not only the target archer, this is, there's a huge benefit here for the bow hunter as well. Now that we've gone over the new 2020 Elite Bows, the result and the cure, I'm gonna demonstrate for you how all this new technology works. I've got a paper tuning rack in front of me here. It's the most common way for people to tune their bow. So I got this bow put together here. I'll shoot an arrow out of it, see what I get, and then we'll make an adjustment from there. It's not bad, it's a little bit tail left. So all you do is set technology, is loosen these lockdown screws, and there's two micro adjust screws on the side. I'm gonna give these an eighth of a turn of adjustment. And I got a, just a hair of a tail left tear, so I'm gonna go counterclockwise an eighth of a turn, top and bottom. An eighth of a turn goes pretty far. I actually flipped just from a barely left tear to just a right tear. So I'm gonna go back just a little bit, and you can see how quick these adjustments are to make. I'm not using a bow press, all I have is an Allen wrench. That looks pretty good. No more adjustment needed there. Uh, so in the matter of three shots and about 60 seconds, we got this bow dialed in. Now I wanna show you, I'll take this bow intentionally out of tune and show kind of the range of a left tear and a right tear that I can get and dial it back into a bullet hole adjust this to the right. So I would be doing this if I was getting a right tear. 
So I should get a left tear now after I make this adjustment. So I went about a full revolution on the set micro adjust screw. So now you can see that's about a one inch left tear. I'll take the adjustment the other way and see what I get. So I got a left tear, so I would turn this counterclockwise on the micro adjust screw. Take it all the way the other way. one inch right tear. So I've taken this bow from a perfect bullet hole to a one inch left tear to a one inch right tear which shows the range of adjustment you can get out of the set technology. Now I'll take it back so I've got a one inch right tear back to the middle and shoot it one more time. back to a bullet hole. So you can see two minutes we went bullet hole, one inch right tear, one inch left tear, back to a bullet hole. No bow press, no special tools. I never left the line. That's set technology. With the 2020 lineup from Elite Archery, I'm confident this is the easiest, most effective tuning bow platform on the market today, whether you're a bow hunter or a target archer.